We got a little sneak peek at this did. when we were there last week. The, I we think did. the construction was still going on, but um, the excitement's building. It and really the day will be is. here before we know it. We saw the, the curtains kind of uh, hiding what was going on behind there, but you're going to be able to see what's behind those curtains later this week. So we have Larry Lucas, Chairman of Revolutionary Racing, and Connor Lucas, Vice President of Government uh, Relations for Revolutionary Racing. And thank you all so much for stopping by. Thanks for having us. Well, yeah. Susan Taylor, thank you. We're really thrilled to be uh -huh. here today. Well, well welcome to Boy County, welcome to the area. Yes. I, I guess, let me ask the two of you, when you were looking for a location to open this up, I know, you know, talk has been here for a while and I know a lot mm -hmm. of work happened to, to get this going, but um, I don't, why Boy County? Yeah. What, what made well, you want to locate it's here? A, it's a very exciting place to be and uh, the local government officials were so welcoming mm -hmm. in the community. And, uh, you know, we've hired 250 people. The quality of the workforce is just outstanding. Oh, that's great. Uh, it's just awesome. Mm -hmm. So we love being here. Okay. Mm -hmm. So now when the doors open Thursday evening, what are we in for? What are we going to see and be the, able to do? The treat of your life. Oh, the treat <laughs> of your life. Okay. okay. No, we're very excited. 7 o'clock Thursday uh -huh. night, be there, be square. Yep. Um, you know, so we have the latest gaming machines in, uh, in the country, uh -huh. and uh, it's uh, be very exciting, full entertainment. Uh, Connor, you 50,000 square feet, 700 games, two stages. We have a dueling piano stage at the center bar. You walk in, we have this beautiful bar. Wow. Oh, how cool is that? Uh, it's really uh -huh. wonderful. We're going to have Cole Chaney and Noah Thompson on Thursday night, too, so. Oh, wow. It's just going to be, be fun a fun atmosphere, yeah. right? Yeah. We're very um, excited. Well, that's, that's great, mm -hmm. and I think I even saw, too, that we, we're going to have some dignitaries, I think, um, maybe Maybe the governor is going to be joining us yeah, for the, the uh, ribbon the cutting will for be this there, yeah. and yeah. Uh, and uh, Rocky Atkins uh -huh. and uh, uh -huh. the local uh, state reps, uh, Representative yeah. Sheriff, yeah. and uh, uh, we'll, we'll have the the full full crowd. Uh -huh. Now I know you all are still going to be doing some work after this, right? I mean, we're opening up the the gaming part of this, yes. but later is it next fall that you all are still thinking for? The, the racing to start there? Is that it, what we're thinking? It'll be in 25. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, I was trying to jump you up a year. You're like, no, yeah, listen, yeah, we need a little bit more time. It takes a little while, right? But so 2025 is when That's we'll right. start. It's quarter horse racing that'll be that, taking place there, right? Uh, quarter horse racing is coming back to the Commonwealth. Oh, how fun. Oh, that yeah. is it's very fun exciting. to see. But, and a really lot is. different in the sense of the racing community, right? Mm -hmm. um, you know, I think a lot of people are familiar with going to watch like thoroughbred racing right. and stuff like that, but it's a little bit different. We call the most exciting 19 seconds in sports. <laughs> <laughs> the most exciting 19 seconds in sports. Oh well, that, my goodness. That's right. So that'll that'll happen in 2025. Uh -huh. um, so tell us, I mean, what are what are some of the other things that I know here in a second we're going to see some of the, the menu options. You've yep. got a, yeah. a little spot to grab a bite to eat. And, mm -hmm. um, I guess everybody can just make a, a whole day out of it when, when you go to Sandy's. Yeah, and, and the other cool thing is, is uh, as Connor said, we're going to have two stages. So We'd like to think that we might become an incubator for the local talent. That is Because we'll have a lot of availability time uh -huh. for the local artists to be able That's to perform. That's wonderful. Because yeah. we have a lot of great There's musical talent. There's a lot talent. of great music around yeah. here. Mm -hmm. well, let us know if you know anybody because we got time to fill 365 Perfect. Great. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. we, we, I think uh, we've got a list. That, yeah. We yeah. dig. A lot of us stop performers over perform, here. Yep. So that is mm -hmm. great. We're looking at some beautiful uh, video from the area that you picked. So, I mean, it's, it's, it really is, like you said, it's going to be very exciting. You can make a whole day of it. Now, you all have partnered with Vet MGM for a sportsbook lounge at Sandy's. What can you tell us about that? Well, it, it's, it's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. So we have three huge TVs mm -hmm. that are in there with all, well, at every sporting event. Uh, and MGM's been a great partner. It's, mm -hmm. it's, you know, we think it's nice to have bring, in, bring in the lion to Boyd yes. County, right? Uh -huh. right? You know, it's kind of cool. Uh -huh. And... Um, the, it's going to be, uh, we have 5,000 square feet. It's an enormous sport, mm -hmm. sport betting lounge. It'll be the best place to watch a sporting event in all of eastern Kentucky yeah. and the tri-state area. It sounds like it, yeah. A well, it, it's amazing to see this um, come to fruition mm -hmm. and, and to be here. Um, I, let's talk a little bit more, though. Again, I know we're looking future plans, but as far as the racetrack and the equestrian center, is that going to be located right there by Sandy's? Is that where the location's yeah, going right, to be for that? It'll be right behind Sandy's. Okay. The cool. land is actually adjoining, but um, it's about 100 yards behind us and about mm, 300 yards up. So, so it's all right there, all your we entertainment got our right there. first bulldozers up there the other day, so we're oh, starting wow. to level some land as you know flat land's not easy to come by sure uh -huh. so uh we, we did the best we could and we, we got some work to do yeah, yeah. so yeah. The, the equestrian center though well i mean will they have some of the the quarter horses there when it comes time for the racing that people will be able to 
I don't know, get oh, to, yeah. to we'll see have, the horses we'll and the have jockeys. Stables, and we'll have stables, so all the horses that ship in Pally. for the races, we'll have stables for those. The equestrian center will be there as well, and hopefully that will be another entertainment center, you know, double as an entertainment center as well, so when equestrian events aren't happening, we can have some yeah. entertainment options Oh, that's there exciting. As well. well, and I bet that's great for the two of you all, because I think a lot of times people around here, they're like, oh, I got to drive to go do right. stuff. Yeah. Right. Not the case yeah. anymore. You've got no, something no. right here in your backyard. Mm -hmm. Right, and it's a beautiful piece of property because it overlooks the whole valley. Mm -hmm. it, it's pretty cool up there. Mm -hmm. And that was one of the big things when we came here, Judge Cheney said, is one of my biggest initiatives is quality of life. How can we attract more business? to the area right. we don't have stuff for people to do, right. right? So we're trying to fill that gap and we're trying, we're hoping we're doing a good well, job. Well, it sounds like you are. And this Thursday evening, you all can also come see it for yourself and see what they have there at uh, Sandy's Racing Is Day. the celebration taking place at Sandy's or are you gonna be doing the, the whole thing somewhere else? Where's this all oh, happening no, on no. Thursday? Everything It'll be there? Everything will happen okay. at, at mm -hmm. Sandy's. All right. uh, and uh, you know the the governor's very excited, you know, to have you know to announce all these jobs and uh -huh. everything. Uh, uh, and then at seven o'clock, it's going to be open to the public, and we hope everybody comes. That's right. <laughs> and yeah. then it's full steam ahead. Yeah, full well, steam ahead. Mm -hmm. I think we have to bring you back, um, the two of you, to talk about the progress on everything else. Absolutely. But again, congratulations mm -hmm. on yes. on what you got going. Exciting. And we, we are so glad to have you on the show today. Uh -huh. And um, I know we're not done talking about it we're yet not, because I'm seeing some, there's some food involved. Yumminess over there too. <laughs> <Good> <laughs> Well, Larry Connor, great to talk with both of you. Yes. Thank you so Thank much, you and congratulations on the opening us. of this place. <laughs>